Greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Play uh, Tropico 4 in the mission Tropico Above All. Uh, that's not good. President, I, you didn't actually take the warning from the Van Hoof woman seriously, did you? Of course, we need to continue with, to make our papaya bigger. We just Agent need Sasha, a bit of expertise to help you nature. To have a whole, whole horticulture station near four of your papaya farms. You, Reward the quality price of papaya will increase by 100%. Very good. Uh, that's extinguish that. It's expensive. But that's fine. To spread the light of communism for future generations. Yes, yes, this is good and all, but really, I want to know how you got that gorgeous hair. And there's the rain again. And we definitely will need some... Uh... Presidente, that Hooves woman is trying to stop us. She has made it hard for us to get building materials. As a result, all of our buildings are 50% more expensive. Well, that's not very nice. Luckily, most of my buildings that I wanted to build are being built. At least the drought is over. What matter requires Presidente's attention? And now I just need to start making money again. Yet. And no, I don't want to do Presidente. that. Presidente! The communist leader hates me enough already. I don't need to arrest him. Well, at least the happiness is crawling back up. Alright, where's my workers? Come on. Get off your lazy bones and start building stuff. Don't have the money to qu quick build at the moment. Some Colombian barons have larger yeah, yeah, armies yeah. than us. Export cigars. President, the U.S. Sure, Senate is not, not happy with That's actually a mistake because I can't do that. Surprise, Presidente, and even stranger, a good surprise. <laughs> the nations of the world hate Brunhilde von Hoof so much that they have collected twenty thousand dollars as a token of gratitude for crossing her. Well, with enemies like that, who needs friends? And let's just get the Childhood Museum out of the way as well. And... a high school. Because we will want to start building stuff that I can actually use. Uh, plantation... Coffee... Yeah, coffee is the only thing that's really viable. Let's make my tenements free. More than 100 citizens. A small step for the world. A giant leap for tropical. No. Not gonna execute criminals. That is not a very good way to conduct business. Let's just build. The horticulture station, and let's see if we need more than that. Let's also uh, not rely completely on our uh, life st or uh, stuff. See, where's the box I deposit? Was here in town, wasn't it? Yep, there it is. Right behind the school. Ah, oh, threat. 
there. Well, that's nice. Not yet. I'll do that in a moment, when I've got some more money to play around with. And I have to play with the import mechanics. Since I can't really grow uh, tobacco on this island to any effective rate. A secret oh, okay. task. Very well. This is a formal warning that we do not like you and think bad things about you. If you do not stop your current plans to undermine our work, we will be forced to send an even s you an even sterner note. Be afraid. Sincerely, Brunhild von Hoof. Yes. It seems I do not have the authority to stop you from building. Your building prices will return to normal. Bad Presidente, I love bad publicity. That derogatory note made the entire world aware of Tropico and our struggle to win world records. Now is the time to strike. We need to accomplish five more records and we will officially be the most popular country in the world. And the next, the largest population. Comrade. The records you said will display communism as a shining example. I have a proposition to help. The people of China are many and industrious, like all workers should be. However, there are enemies of progress everywhere, and they want to get rid of theirs. We will give all of China tropical citizenship and sentiment to us. If we accept these wretched souls and show them the beauty of tropical communism, they will mend their ways for sure. Also, the record for the greatest population will be ours, for progress. A free dog to accommodate the influx of population. Yeah. Have enough dogs. That's a rather silly thing to aspire to, since I'm quite certain I could never fit a billion people on Tropico. Let's see. Hey, boss man! The record thing is really doing good for the self-esteem of me and my boys. Way to go! How about you do something more? Let's become the country with the biggest territory. I know your ridiculous stance on attacking the superpowers, and I still think we can uh, do it if we catch them by surprise. Crime. But I have you something have different in mind. Esteban. That's the next Mars. That we only need to shoot a flag there. With a cheap, shabby nuclear program to shoot a tropical flag to Mars. Award, biggest Indeed. territory award. Oh, have we fallen. All right, not. Uh, not that's repent. quite enough of that for there now. Be a police force to make them repent. Amen. Let's uh, get more building stuff done. Building stuff. Brilliant, brilliant wording. All right, let's get a road over to here. And we want a. Mine for gold. And then we'll just build a dock over here. Once we've unlocked it. Alright. And that can wait. Those things don't go anywhere anyway, so... Alright, and I'll just set up another dock over here. Also, if I'm gonna have that many people, I will want some fishermen's wharves. 
And I know I'm overbuilding stuff, but frankly, we'll need it. Alright. There's two salt mines up here. I'll take this one because it's relatively closer. And that wasn't actually connected. Right. And let's set up a cigar factory, which allows imports. And I'll quick build this. And then we spent all the money, again. Right, more tenements. We'll need all the people to be housed when they arrive. marketplace over here as well. Anyone else? Interior, can't do that yet. Economy... I'll wait until I have the school set up. That I don't have any room for more uh, programs. Presidente, it's not just about achieving records, but also getting people to hear about it. We need the media on our side. This will be a great publicity, and he can bring in lots of cash. You will receive $5,000 for every journalist on the island when you complete a record. Great. And I currently don't have any journalists. Do I even have trained people? I have a few college educated people. Nowhere near enough though. Alright. School has been built. How's the population doing? Still some unemployed. So what is actually the price for papaya at the moment? Ooh, very good. Yeah. Uh, Presidente, we... there has been a huge revolution in several Middle Eastern countries. Several leaders supported by the U.S. are likely to be replaced soon. However, the revolutions are led by what some call extremists. Yeah, we don't support extremists. Uh, I would like to do that, but I can't. So I won't. Uh, President yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll talk about the environment. I'll praise... I'll praise... Who do I praise? I'll praise the U.S. and I'll promise adequate housing. Go. My fellow constituents, I want to stress the great progress we have made. Production has increased steadily, exceeding 25% in some areas. I tell you, we will complete the five-year plan in four years. This is progress. I must warn you about the so-called rebels on our island. Those are anarchists who could not care less for this island, but present themselves as its liberators. Because of their nihilistic ways, all of our environmental efforts were ruined. 
the United States helping Tropicans and all the people around the world to defend freedom and democracy deserve our respect, our thankfulness, our friendship. Our close relationship and common ideals will help us find a way to Never feel the world president is No here. one can deny the amazing development that is happening in Tropico within just one mandate. I have an even more astonishing future in store for all of you. I promise you that in my next term, people will no longer have to live in shacks. See you at the Grand Fiesta after the victory. And that should go fine. Happiness is all pretty much up. I just really need to do something about the pollution, that's all. How's the occupancy rate? Still some shacks. But we're bringing in loads of cash. Which is then generally good. Right. Let's open the borders again. Oh, people just love me. There's no need for fraud on this. Angry eco activists. All right, all right, all right. I'll build the garbage dump. Heck, I'll build two. Yay! Uh, President, may your children no, be many. Do that. All right. Ah, uh, hurricane, tornado! Ah, oh, crap! An enemy tornado! Shoot! Go away! Put on your belt and go back to America. I hate tornadoes. The tornado retreated, Presidente. Yeah. I'll need to do something about that. I mean, I don't... I almost don't mind that it is destroying buildings. After all, I am swimming in money at the moment, so I can easily replace them. And I will, because I can. But that just so annoys. What do you want? I'm busy ruling. Uh, I'll take you. It's possible that those were the uh, experts I hired. But we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Thank you for watching. 
See you next time. We need pro